Tigers head. Time for the sports with Ken Truett. It's 15 before 8 o'clock. Well, good morning, everybody. And now all playoff positions have been decided in the National Football League. Going into last night's Monday night football game, the teams had been decided, but who they played had not been. We'll be back with more on that after this word from Highline Truck and Tractor. Put old man winter in his place. Hit her and chew your place with an international harvester snowblower. Monday night football last night, the Orange Crush was beaten by San Diego 17-7. Chargers over the Broncos. Dan Fultz set a single season passing record last night. He had 230 yards in the contest. His record now stands at 4,082 yards in one season. That breaks Joe Namath's mark of 4,007 yards back in 1967. The Chargers win the AFC Western Division and we'll wait until two weeks from now before they begin their playoffs. Next weekend, it's the two wild card games in the NFC. Chicago travels to Philadelphia, and in the AFC, the Broncos will take on the Houston Oilers. The National Hockey League last night won game. Minnesota beat Toronto 5-1. to Al McAdam with three goals. A lot of penalties in that contest, over 100 minutes, several fights, and a couple of game misconducts. In the Izvestia Hockey Tournament over in Moscow, Sweden beat Canada yesterday 7-2. That marks the second straight defeat for the Canadian selects. And Finland tied Czechoslovakia 4-4. In the pre-Olympic tournament at Lake Placid, New York, Canada fared little better. The U.S. Olympic team, and they've got a good one this year, they downed Canada 3-1. Czechoslovakia and Sweden tied at 3. In Industrial Hockey League action last night, Midwest down the Wapiti Aviation Flyers 6-2. And in the Western Hockey League, Portland beat Seattle by a count of 8-1. More sports after this. 